Hey folks, BFG Neil here, and today I'm going to be talking about the Brown Tab object locators. Now these are great little trackers for the Helium network that I've been using for a few years now. I really like the flexibility of just being able to pop these in a bag and being able to track something. Okay, so let's go over it. The Brow Antan measures in at 50mm by 12mm by 50mm with a weight of 30 grams. It's got a 540mAh LiPo battery and contains a GPS sensor, 3D accelerometer and a push button. The 3D accelerometer detects movement and starts sending uplinks every 30 seconds. When idle it checks in every 2 hours. It's all enclosed in an IP64 rated case which means it's protected from total dust ingress and from water spray in any direction. It achieves this by providing a little dust and water protection cover for its USB slot. It's the perfect little tracker for on the go whether that's tracking keys, your laptop bag or even things like musical instruments. But the hardware here is only one half of the story. You need to be able to see the data and that's where my app Trackpack comes in. Trackpack simplifies the process of using the Helium network by allowing you to add Brow and Tabs object locators by just scanning the QR code on the back of them. For this QR code to work, it's important that you purchase a Trackpack enabled Brow and Tabs object locator. So please visit our website trackpack.io to see a full list of distributors. Trackpack keeps track of the location check-ins and plots them on a map for you. You can filter by date, manage many devices, and get push notifications when the battery is running low. You can also set up a geofence and get a push notification when a tracker enters or enters a geofence. Great for things like knowing when an object leaves or enters your house. All of this is available for just $40 a year per tracker. Check out trackpack.io if you would like to learn more. After adding it to trackpack you need to turn the device on. First push a button to work out if it's in flight mode. If the light doesn't flash up then hold the button down for 15 seconds until the light flashes. This will then turn the device on. If you ever want to confirm your location, simply push the button. This will also show you that the tab is on. If you find that the object locator isn't working, simply push the button to confirm if it's on. But if you need to restart it, simply hold it down for 15 seconds until the light flashes rapidly. And now push the button to confirm it's off and simply hold the button for 15 seconds until the light flashes rapidly. And now we can confirm it's working by pushing the button. When charging the brow and tab object locator, the LED will pulse slowly when it's fully charged. And that's it for today's video. Please check back soon as this is the first in a series of asset trackers for the Helium network. And if you like this video, please consider liking and subscribing. Bye for now.